the first question is really need to create a song. To answer this question, actually, we need to say why we uh, why do we need to build a song? And the first thing we need to get, if we look to urban soils, we will ask ourselves, are urban soils really healthy or not? And if you look here uh, to this photo, for example, we can see actually different problems or in urban soils, such as, for example, here, without talking about contaminated, actually, all these soils from Europe and from the United States, we don't have any problem with contamination, but here we have uh, problems, for example, of compaction, we have here problem of limited spaces, problem of soil structure, so we can, the soil could not really store the water. We have a problem of sealing, problem of strange materials, such as here, huge quantity of cigarette. And we have also here, this photo also is taken from Europe, where we can see after just one storm, the trees start to die or the root system really tired and the soil here show a, um, let's see, show not, the soil is really not healthy. And here, when we talk about soil, if the soil is healthy or not, as I said, it's not just about contamination, it's about the diversity of the soil, about structure of the soil, about aggregation, density, etc. So the, what we need to do actually, or what's happening in, to build the soil in urban area in general, we took the soil from the city and we throw it out so that's the city when they are tired or when they are sick. And then we brought actually the soils from all the city to the city, which is also a problem because the soil is limited resource and this resource is not removable. So in addition to that, we, you, I think everybody don't like to see this, huge quantity of the tracks loaded with waste and here I will talk, uh, I insist just about construction and demolition waste because for me this is the most waste that could not be recycled easily but however you can see huge quantity of waste go to the land field in the city which in general of course uh, will will rise a huge quantity of carbon dioxide which will also related to um, uh, environmental problems and diesel exhaust in addition of course this will be so highly cost. So the idea using this west in urban area and still before bring natural soils to build the soil in different contexts of an urban area. For example, for parks or near to history building or for, for example, specific design and urban agriculture, street trees. Here also we have BS wells, actually this photo also taken by George from uh, in New York. And here we have, for example, this photo of Boston. Again, as you see here, the soil builds we will, uh, will be submitted to huge stress. Like you see here, for example, we have a, uh, just it's raining and we see a lot of problem with the soil, such as erosion, etc. Or for the uh, green roof, for pots, for symmetry. Uh, so we need to build the soil for different years. And one of the things when we build this soil, we need to think what's the land use and how we will adapt the new soil for this land use. For, for example, I will just give an example here firstly. When we talk about soil for parks and square lawns, or we need to, uh, to talk about how we created this soil to support certain soil functions, such as biomass production, water supply function, uh, carbon, uh, carbon storage, and of course, so we need to insist in, uh, on specific parameters help us to create these soils. So now, how do we build the soil? So when we look to this picture, it just mixing these two materials actually will not build the soil. I always say that mixing sugar and flour will not make a cake. So mixing just different type of waste will not provide the soil to provide different ecosystem service because we need to answer, we need to just, to build the soil, we need to know really what is the soil. And it's so funny to introduce that here with people, all the people here, I know they love the soil, so they know really what is the soil. But let's say, let's say, um, let's say soil is actually have, it's like us, have a different characteristic, uh, have a different story, and every soil actually 
have different parameters and provide different functions. So actually also like us have an age or we measure cells by age, by years, and this cells could be not old and in general better when it's mature soil. But the difference, of course, every one centimeter of soil, if we are lucky, it needs around 10,000 years to have it. And here we talk about urban climate, for example, in Europe, where in another climate, so more than millions of years to have just one centimeter of soil. So to build a soil, we need to understand completely what is the soil, or how this soil will be the process of the soil developing. And here, if we talk about the just the first the soil structure or the first horizon we need to check about when we mix in minerals and organic waste we will not have this directly this association actually of organic mineral materials where we see here of this or this a huge quantity of actually different type of aggregation and this arrangement of aggregation is so important in the soil because here when we talk about nutrient cycling here when we talk about the mass production support to plant, plant growth here we talk about carbon storage and here we talk about um, uh, fixing heavy metals in the soils. So it's so important and here, for example, this soils actually from also my work with George in, in, in green infrastructure on soils. how you see uh, guts of earth soil also constructed techno soil. So also again, mixing organic waste and mineral waste it's not enough because we don't also have a microphone and this is one of the problems when we create a soil or we we'll build the soil. Again, soil also, when we go in deep, soil will have a different horizon. So when we mimic or build the soil, we need to think about each, every, sorry, about every detail because it's every detail is so important. Here we try to mimic actually different type of soils from France. This work in work also, uh, we did that in our section in USI in 2017. We, we, the order of horizon is so important when we think about global soil. So now I will give to give some examples when we build the soil, what we need to avoid a little. So we have this mineral waste. We need firstly, of course, not to just mix mineral waste alone. We need to mix mineral with organic waste. Then this mineral with organic waste, we will have, for example, here I present an example of excavated deep horizon with papers, actually paper rest and here breaks with paper rest. Then we can see, for example, we need to organize this waste based of their characteristic in different horizon, which I already talked about it. And we also need to provide directly plant cover because the soil we create is just a baby soil. It's just a new soil. And this soil need to, the right is for me to help us to create this aggregation to Encourage, encourage the biodiversity to encourage macrofauna uh, and to encourage microorganisms in the soil. So here, for example, you can see also one of the uh, one of the work I did during my PhD with um, high school students. You can see, for example, here the rises far in in such mixture of ways, really develop it and can um, aggregate and fix these soils. Where, for example, here the soil is just uh, a result from uh, cycle cycling of wet and dry soil, uh, wet and dry cycle. Sorry, so you can see here the uh, soil, the road system is not developed because the mixture wasn't the, this mixture of waste wasn't that good. Again, if we give here different examples, we have here different examples from France actually uh, to different type of soils on how I will we will organize this soils uh, to for parks. You can see actually here for trees, we go with the square of uh, horizon for, uh, we call it the horizon uh, growth for growth. And, and in general, here this horizon will be more rich of organic material. We will go more in depth, where, for example, the surrounding horizon should be more minerals. So this, the root system will not have this conflict, uh, conflict with the uh, streets or, or the gray system, which is so important. And in, in some cases, these trees or this building soil actually show more efficient work or more functions than even natural soils on urban area. So think about every detail, how soils function, how soils work. It's so important to provide the ecosystem service we wait from the soil when we build it. 
Again, here, this example from New York City, this is what we work, it's a different views, views world. And here, for example, one of the things, I, not only the structure or the design, it's also, uh, there's deep thinking between, uh, about that, but also this soil is provided with age directly. So the age also something important when we build the soil because the soil will go just with just one storm, because I already said the soil, there's no, no aggregation already there. So there's no resistance of our region yet. Finally, uh, here example for uh, green roof. And for me, actually building a soil, it's so important more than for, for such, for pots or uh, for, sorry, for bucks uh, or uh, for green roofs as actually there's no soil there. So mixing these materials and here are, again, this is experience from France. Um, the three experience actually from France. So, so could give also for graded land for here a, a different mixture for a green roof. And uh, both mixture actually provide a good production, of the, uh, a good biomass production. So I will stop here. Thank you so much, very much for your attention.